This is the awesome Treasure Hunter Easter Egg on Terminus and Black Ops 6 Zombies, and this will also get you the Treasure Hunter achievement slash trophy, which is to find the final talisman. So in order to do this, you first need to buy Mele Macchiato. So get enough points and buy that for 3,500, or if you get lucky as a loot. Now you need to head over to the Sea Caves, and right here, you need to punch it with your fist, now upgraded with the perk. This will open up the gap, and then this ancient captain will talk to you. Hey, captain's quarters, keep out. No visitors till I start getting back what's mine. In this new wide open gap, you will now see a treasure map, identical to the in-game tack map in the game, with a random point marked X. You need to head to where this spot is marked on the map, indicative in your game. When you head over to this marker, you will be within the water, and you will find a watch. So go ahead and collect that and return to the surface. Now you need to return back to where the captain was and give it to him. He then instructs you that you need to burn the remains of his traitorous crew and get his coins back. Now hear this. That old wristwatch you found is property of Captain Thomas Gray, US Merchant Marine. So my crew mutinied and us around here. The lousy thief and stevedores. They stole my damned coin collection, and I'm in no shape to take it back. Whatever's left of my old crew, you burned the stinking bones to ashes. Am I clear? Dismissed. There will now be three new parts marked as X's on the map. Here marked on Temple Island in the north, the shipwreck, and... Castle Rock Island in the east. In each of these locations, you will find a skeleton on the ground, which must be ignited via various pieces of equipment, such as the Molotov or the Thermo Grenade. That's what this is. A crime like that, you can't forget. In doing so, it will spawn a HVT Mangler, which you then have to defeat. After defeating the HVT, a cursed coin will drop. You then need to bring that coin back to the captain. And like I say, you need to then do this exact same step twice more at the other two locations, each time bringing the coin back to the captain after collecting it. After giving the third coin back to the captain, he will give you a bunch of legendary weapons as rewards. Now the map will have another X mark on it, as you can see in the center of Crab Island in the south. Heading to the center of the island, you now need to survive three rounds. At the start of the fourth round, lightning will strike with a chest spawning containing the cursed talisman. Collect the talisman, and whilst wearing the talisman, all kills will now give double points, but being hit will cause you to lose 10% of your points because it is cursed. This is the cursed talisman with a grace period between cooldown. You can return the talisman to the chest you picked it up from, and other players in your match can also pick it up from there if they want to do this for themselves. So it's a risk versus reward thing if you want to keep it. This is definitely useful to gain a lot of points, especially on those lower rounds, and I really like this easter egg. I think this is one of the best side easter eggs honestly we've ever gotten because it actually has narrative and lore to the map that's kind of separate from the map itself it's the ancient ruins of the island digging up some of its history literally and i definitely want to see more stuff like this in the future so basically you now have unlimited double points so long as you can survive the increased difficulty without further ado that is the guide i will have plenty more tutorials coming up on the channel so stay tuned